Well, there are five of the top names in international golf, and they're here in Victoria for the 2010 TELUS World Skins Game. It is the first time the event has been held in the capital. It's generating a lot of excitement and attracting huge crowds. More than 5,000 spectators on hand today at the Bear Mountain Resort watching golfers such as Mike Weir and Fred Couples tackling the challenging mountain course. Myra will have details in just a couple of minutes, but first A News reporter Eric Thompson, who was in that gallery today with some of the other faces attending attending the game. Eric. Yeah, certainly were a lot of big names out today, people who just love golf as well. And this is the fifth time our province has hosted the World Skins game, which has transformed Bear Mountain into the center of the golf universe. If you love golf, Bear Mountain Resort is the place to be. Thousands of spectators are here watching five of the top names in golf battle it out for a good cause. Tellus is donating proceeds from this event to the Queen Alexandra Foundation for Children in support of Janice Place, a home away from home for children and their families who travel to Victoria for specialized pediatric treatment. TELUS donates dollars to Janice Place, but we also say come and join us, help out and be part of the community. And that's what makes uh, Janice so successful is that you know, people will come and gather around her and, and lift her up and, and everybody around her. It's a really a great feeling for all of us. For TELUS, the Skins game also provides an opportunity to promote its new product, Optic TV. The company is donating $100 toward Janice Place on behalf of every new subscriber on Vancouver Island. You'll see a number of well-known faces in the crowd here at Bear Mountain, including General Rick Hillier, retired. He is here with the military contingent, and TELUS and Bear Mountain hosting more than 100 members of the military as a way of recognizing them and saying thanks. Tell us, put the offer out to the commander out here in the western part of Canada, and they went out to the various organizations and units that make up the command, selected deserving men and women to come up here, and I met them all this morning. I think we had 60 here this morning, and again, 60 tomorrow, and the 60 this morning were absolutely ecstatic to be here, felt nine feet tall, felt that they were being appreciated and recognized and valued for their contribution to our country. The TELUS World Skins game is a big boost for the local economy. More than 5,000 people are expected to attend the event each day. Additional staff have been hired to help out at the resort, including the Mountain View Lounge, a 9,000-square-foot climate-controlled space that took more than a week to construct. Probably nothing like this ever has ever been set up in Victoria before. And you think about the economic impact of the tent, let alone the whole Skins game. How's your golf game? My golf game is uh, not like Mike's. But you know what the thing about if, uh, going to a TELUS Skins game? You get to see how great the players are. Because you, you might just imagine that, you know, I'm not so bad. You watch these guys play, it's phenomenal. The five golfers, including Canadian Mike Weir, will play another nine holes tomorrow for a prize total of $360,000. Hudson, lots of VIPs expected in the Mountain View Lounge tonight, and we hear there is a big concert. We're not sure who it is, uh, but it's a big name, and it's a very well-kept secret. All right. Well, we'll keep an open to that. Eric, thank you. You're welcome. Eric Thompson.